So you might be trying to figure out how you can inspect elements on your particular iPhone. Now, doing this is actually fairly basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all, but it's actually pretty cool. It does require you to have some sort of Siri shortcut installed on your particular iPhone. So make sure you have that shortcuts application. And the next thing is we're going to want to go ahead and make sure that we have this particular shortcut installed. So I'll try to leave a link down in the description if I forget to. Just go to shortcutsgallery.com and search for edit website. Now when you have this, all you're going to want to do is you want to go and click on get shortcut. And what this is going to allow you to do is it's going to allow you to add this shortcut. So tap on add this shortcut at the very bottom and you want to make sure it you know, appears in share sheet when you share it out. You want to make sure it shares that. Now when you want to go and start running this, what you want to do is you want to make your way over into any website. So in this case, we can make our way over into this website right here, the edit website portion. And what we want to do is we want to click on the share button at the bottom. So in the bottom middle, tap on the share button right here. And you want to go ahead and just make sure that where it says at the very bottom, it should say something like edit web page. So I have that right here. All I have to do now is go and click on the edit web page button. And this little panel will come up. All you want to do is go and click on allow. Now, sometimes you might get a pop-up that tells you something about security, fixed security, something like that. If that ends up happening, just go ahead and allow that within the settings. But in this case, now when you're ready, you can go and start tapping on portions of this website, and you can actually start changing the text. So now if I wanted to change this, I can just change it to whatever else I want to. I can change this text up here if it's text to something else. I can change this text here to something else too. I can delete text. So that's basically how you do it. Most of the people who are going to be inspecting Element will basically be wanting to change stuff here within these web pages. And that's basically how you do it. I think there's also a way to kind of copy out the actual text on here too, but that's basically how it's done. And whenever you're ready, you can just go and exit out of it. And when you exit out of it, you'll be able to just use that page as you normally would. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that'll mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.